Hey, it's Kevin again. I'm kind of in a habit or just a mood to record a bunch of stuff that just is my day to day, make my life easier type stuff. So real short things. Um, I go on a lot of different clients every day, you know, three or four at least per day and do daily check type work. And that needs to be quick in order for me to be efficiently handling multiple clients. And my team does the same thing. And this is the same process we always use. I thought I'd share it with you. Uh, if you've seen my registered server videos, I'm going to use that technique now. Um, as you can see, I've got my prod group here. It's only got my two instances in. I can tell they're both running because the uh, the green there. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to go in, open up to my folder. Probably, hey, went to the right folder. That's awesome. I've got these three scripts at the top. Got a, They start with an underscore, so it'll be at the top of the list and easy for me to find. I have another one there because I do a lot of index tuning. But I'll open these up against my group, which could be one server, it could be 50 servers. It doesn't really matter as long as they're online. At the bottom, you'll see they all say connected two out of two, which is what I want. So when I run these, you know, I can just go, we'll run them one right after the other. And you know, for the most part, they're going to finish. These are test boxes, so it, they, they just go just like that. Your mileage may vary, especially on a really busy box. But I get all these results. Now, I often, because I've got a dedicated jump box for a lot of clients, I will leave Management Studio open for days, weeks, or even months at a time because nobody cares. Nobody else is using it. But I'll also be, when I see something I want to look at, I'll have to go create a new query to do some kind of research, another new query to look for something else. And it bugs me. I'm sure there's better answers. But it bugs me that my tabs are starting to slide off and I can't see them anymore. And i got to go down here, especially when I've done like five or six different things. And I've got a lot of queries open, and now I don't even know which one's which because I haven't saved them yet. Solution for this, go to Tools, Options, and Tabs in Windows right here, and check this box. Show pinned tabs in a separate row, and that's going to put these tabs above the other ones, but not automatically. That's a, that's a setting that persists. When you close Manager Studio and come back, it'll still be checked. So I go over here, I'm like, okay, where's my jobs query? Oh, there it is. I'll do that. Now that it's highlighted, I'll pin it. And now it's on its own dedicated row. So I'll do that for the others as well, because I use these all the time. I want them to always be there. And I may have a window with like, who is active in it. I'm going to want that at the top if I'm troubleshooting an issue so I can always find it quickly. And that's what this is all about, is finding the things that need to hang out as you go through and open a bunch of new queries like this, because who, know, who knows, I might need 57 queries open. These guys at the top are all easy for me to get to because of that one checkbox right there. I mean, like I said, you do have to go in and hit the pin. You know, if I want to pin this one, I can too. Probably doesn't need to. And if you don't need one anymore, just unpin it. It drops back down where it was. Coolest thing, I think I got this tip from Lee Markham, who got it from somebody else or the other way around. Lee Markham is a great guy. Look him up on LinkedIn or Twitter, and you'll get some great DBA stuff out of him, too. But I just thought I'd share that with you. If you have tabs going all over the place because you never close anything like me, this can help you organize the most important ones just a little bit better. Have a great day.